Statistics. The word itself strikes fear into the hearts of many. Don't let it. Statistics is used to explain the world around us using data. It's used in almost every industry, such as psychology, astronomy, logistics, finance, even your local pizza guy. Well, maybe not your local pizza guy. Statistics, as defined by Webster's Dictionary, is a branch of mathematics dealing with the collection, analysis, interpretation, and presentation of masses of numerical data. That was a mouthful. Briefly, statistics collects data to tell us exactly what's happening or predict what will happen. When we collect individual units of data, those are known as observations. Each observation is a series of questions or a series of data points for an individual. In statistics, when we collect individual units of data, we call that an observation. Each component of that observation is known as a variable. Thus, a study can be considered a collection of observations where each observation has a number of variables. While studies may be a questionnaire, studies can also be collected from different observational data points, such as a daily stock price, where each price of the stock on a given day is considered an observation, and the various points of that day, such as the P-E ratio, the stock price, or volume traded, would be considered the variables of that observation. Data collected from these observations can take two forms. They can either be quantitative or qualitative. Quantitative data are data that are numerical in nature where the numbers actually have meaning, such as a test score of an 88 or a 92. Data that's qualitative in nature are categorical, so even if they have numbers, the meaning between the numbers isn't so apparent, such as male and female, where male is 1 and female is 0, 0.5 doesn't make much sense. So the two forms of data are used in statistics in terms of telling us what's happening or what we can predict what will happen. It's actually easy to remember the difference between quantitative and qualitative. Well, if it's quantitative, it's a number for quantity. If it's qualitative, there's a quality around it, and so therefore it's categorical. Let's take a look at a few examples. Height and weight would be quantitative. The gas mileage of a car would also be quantitative. Gender, zero or one, would be qualitative. Ethnicity, zero, one, or two, would be qualitative. A type of dog, zero, one, two, three, would also be qualitative. So a quick recap. Statistics is about studying and analyzing data. We collect a number of observations, and each observation has a number of variables. When we put that together, we call that a study. Each data element that we collect in our observations can either be quantitative or qualitative. Quantitative variables are those that are numerical in nature where the numbers have meanings. Qualitative are those data elements in which the numbers don't actually have meaning but represent some sort of category that are associated with the values that we're representing.